Hello everybody and welcome back to Dark Forest Farm in Stardew Valley where we have nothing going on until the next week which is the Spirit's Eve or Halloween essentially. Um, do we have a Queen of Sauce? We do not. Um, that was weird. It didn't let me leave that using the key commands. Ooh. Kohi. Thank you. Uh, we have nothing extra in here. No, we do not. We need to collect a couple more hazelnuts to make some of that food. Um... Let's drink this coffee. Yes. And let's start the day. It's about one of the battery packs. My TV remote died. Um, okay, that'll be easy. Yes. That's going to be irritating from right there. So let's get rid of that notification. Uh, nothing among these crops are done. I'll grab those in a second. Let's take care of the animals. Oh yeah, that that grass is getting a really short. That's all I have to say. <laughs> um, which means I don't believe it's going to last through the winter, which is bad, or not through the winter, through next season. So. No, I didn't want to milk bone wheel. We, we don't get duck milk here. Um. <laughs> no, not cha. Frown. I wanted to talk to Frown. Uh, throw those up there. Because they're not needed. Sama. And the little rabbit. Did I talk to uh, Witcher? I did. Okay. Uh, let's collect whatever eggs and whatnot that should be up here. Oh, wow. We got a lot of eggs today. Everybody pretty much produced something. Um, Yeah. So, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, let's go up this side. Let's go check on the fields. Do we have anything grown in yet? We do not. So this is actually going to be a pretty simple day. Um, which is fine because we can get the um, battery to Pam pretty easily because of that. Um, well, let's pick up all of this because we know we have the room for it. Throw these in here. And let's get some of these milks and eggs going. Um, let's throw those two up there. One of the eggs. We'll get both of the regular milks going. Uh, we'll get the duck and the... Um, void egg going. Throw those up there. Pass by the wife. And let's throw that in there. We will make a loom here soon enough. Um, that in there. Let's come back down and grab a battery. We have some generating because last episode it was raining. Um. Hmm. So what should we do for this episode? Like, I don't want to say let's go back down in the mine, but really that's pretty much all that there really is to do, unfortunately. Um. Hmm. We can't until Pam gets there. And, well, actually, there's Pam. Um, and we just slowed her down. Pam needs juice. And by juice, we need we mean power. And by power, we mean electricity. And by electricity, we mean a very specific number of volts of a specific amperage. So. <laughs> Anywho, we will wait for Pam to get here. Come on, Pam. I have places I wish to go. Yes. Return when the driver is present. Okay. 
Somehow the machine knows. Pam never goes and tells the machine she's here, but somehow the machine knows. Um. But yeah, because we really need that rabbit's foot to be able to finish anything. So. Um. Yeah. Let's jump down here real quick. Ooh, there's a... Oh, gosh. Out of the darkness it came a dragon. Um, yes. And some iridium. I am not arguing there. We actually do need more iridium for our tools. So that is not bad. We still need a lot more iridium for our tools. Um, although the mega one of the mega bombs would come in real handy right here. Um we do have a little gem bearing ore. Can you drop one? Nope. I swear they do drop uh rabbit's feet. Um It's just it is really rare. <laughs> but I swear it does they do drop them. Um, actually, I think right there would be the best. Um, I heard another dragon. Ow. There we go. Ooh, some spicy eel. I will take the spicy eel, and I will actually eat ones right now. Um... Okay, yeah, I'm going to eat that, and then I'm going to actually fight these dragons. If anything gets a little sketchy, I do have the ladder right here to leave. Oh, really? Ow. He got me every time. Nope, stop it. Is that it? That's it. Okay. Ow. Nope. Stop it. It's kind of funny that the big ones you would think would be able to do more damage, but they don't really do a ton. Um, break that open. By the way, how many Omnis do we have? We have 16 Omni Geodes. Holy cow. We really need to see Clint. <laughs> We've been down here a little too much. Or just right there. And there's a way down if we need it. No! We don't need the lead rod. The lead rod is like the most useless weapon in the game. Oh wow, you just gave me an iridium rod straight up. Or not rod, but bar. Um, Anything else down here? I would say it's due to the lucky addition that the eel, the spicy eel gave. But I'm actually not terribly sure. Ow. Hello. Ow. Okay, if I, I can't let him hit me again. Uh, do I have any food? Any decent food? Um... In fact, the spicy eel won't even give me that much back. <laughs> um, you know, we'll eat the e other edibles we have. So, the algae, the plum. Um, and that's actually it for now. Um, that is enough. As long as I don't get attacked too hard. Wow, that pretty much just reverted what I just ate. <sighs> Anywho, let's take a look. Uh, there we go. And there we go. And there we go. Intense concentration mode. Um, because I don't really want to use more than one unless I get more than one of the spicy eel, so. 
uh, let you go by real quick. Um, this room is actually very, very small, but we will use a bomb. Um, and we have a hole, but we do not want to jump in that hole. I guess we're going to use another spicy eel. Because that's the only major food item we have, and we need some health before we jump in this. Three levels. Um, boxes. Don't mind if I do. Hey, yeah. 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 Um, okay, let's uh, get going. Omni Geode. Um, anything? Anything else? Um, wow, this area is actually a lot bigger than originally looked. Um. This music, I love it. In fact, this music, I think, is very calming comparatively. So, and there's some stairs. Uh, the red ones are poisonous, unfortunately. If you had any purple ones, though, I would gladly tell. Oh, whoa. Hello. There's a lot of those guys in this level. Um, whoa. It's the major day. The major danger in this one. Ow. Okay, that was not low enough. <laughs> um, and nothing else. Okay, so just a bunch of those invincible guys. And there we go. Okay, let's try to find a ladder down. Ooh, two Omni Geodes. That's pretty good. There we go. And attack. No, stop it. And that will replace the damage I just took. Uh, why can I not click it? <laughs> Um, I do hear another slime. Ooh, you're a big one. A Largo. Um. It's unfortunate that Slime Rancher just isn't a very good epic game. Like, it'll take you some time to get through it, but... Um. And there are there is quite a bit to do in it, but it's... I don't know, it just feels a little short of something that could have been, um, like, not that it, not that it's not made well, it's made really well, um, it just feels like there's something missing in it, kind of thing. Like, the addition of the manufacturing of items to get you stuff and stuff kind of prolonged the gameplay, but it didn't, doesn't, it's still missing something. Um, if I do say so myself. And it's not as an insult, um, games aren't terribly easy to make or design. So, um, it could be just that nothing has really worked with how the game is, so... Ooh, stop it. <laughs> that was close. I could have taken a lot more damage right there. Um, oh, hello. No, can, can you come back this way? Yep, yep, just like that. Yep, yep, uh, uh, okay, we're going to the back. <laughs> um. But yeah, because, like, I've had... I have a couple game ideas. Some of them, though, just kind of brick wall really fast um like there's one i have that's kind of an evolutionary game where you're given a world and ooh, a hole Ooh, that hurt um you you kind of semi it's semi god game that you kind of design the world a little bit before uh you Start the creatures in it, but the idea is is to kind of make your own Pokemon. But you know, it's 
not um it's like where do you go from there okay we have to eat another one I don't like eating these because they actually have stats I could use um oh wow that crit <laughs> um but it's like maybe it would work as a good mobile game with uh like you being able to kind of propagate maybe one type of creature that people can put um your creature in or or their creature in your area and then after that you get like a little um and you get like some sort of stats thing maybe but see there's really not much to do beyond uh just waiting for something to evolve that you would want to use so and there's obvious obviously more depth that could be put into it but um it's just oop, more algae yes all the algae we need i'll eat all the algae <laughs> but it's just there's the general design just is not very deep in terms of gameplay there's a lot of cool stuff it can do it's just not a lot of cool gameplay so um but yeah so oh well, that actually got me up pretty nicely um but um ah way down but yeah, so. Um, Slime Rancher is a really cool idea, though. Uh, and it's a really fun game for the most part. Um, and it is worth the money. I would say that. That it's definitely going to eat a good uh, several hours of your life. <laughs> if not more. Um, so I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying its scope is kind of limited it is still under development too so i'm not gonna so it's not that bad um they are expanding it so that there's more to do there's more to uh get but it is actually no maybe that's it it's more of a collector's game that you go around collecting that which you like and or want and just um uh, making the your little ranch effective at being able to keep that specific uh slime so to say so um but yeah and those games always have some limitation to it like me i i'm a very um um oh gosh you can fit through ones on that side okay good to know i didn't know that now i do um but for me, in terms of collector games, um, I usually finish collector games really quick because I get the things I like. And then I'm like, okay, well, I don't want anything more, so I guess I'm done. Um, and Slime Rancher can get like that if you're not a collect them all kind of person. So. so that is a very good point to make, is that if you're one of those people that fill your pokedex if you play pokemon uh slime rancher would be an awesome game for you so um i am getting hurt a little too much no stop stop oh i am so close to dead let's eat this algae um you know what you know what little slime you know what hey hey yes this way and kablooey And there we go. Got some iridium from that last little guy. And I think we're done for the day. We are hurting really bad. Oh, and it's very late. Holy cow. I did not see how late it was. Okay, we need to get back. <laughs> um, anyways, so... So, yeah, if you're... If uh, you're really into Pokemon and you fill your Pokedex, 
Slime Rancher would actually not be a terrible game for you because, uh, well, you can mix the slimes as well to create very unique slimes. I think they need s something to be done with the slimes, though, f to interest me, like that you would need a specific slime to do a specific thing. And I think that's what would sell the gameplay a little bit more for me. Um, oh, I actually got a diamond during that at some point. Um, because right now it's just collecting more, more and more rare slimes to be able to get everything in your place built so that you can, um start manufacturing and then you need more slimes of more variety to make the things and then and then that that's about where I got to in the game. I didn't get much farther than that. Um because it just kind of got boring. I I collected all the stuff. I got all the stuff done. Uh, come on. Oh, that's an egg. Derp. <laughs> come on. I do want to sell these before the night. Um, but like if you could, well, see the, the issue is, is that multiplayer, multiplayer is such a big aspect of most games because single player games can end that there's only so much you can do on your own. And eventually this Stardew Valley is going to end the series. Um, Eventually, I'm going to get everything done. Eventually, there's going to be nothing more to do. Like, that's just an inevi inevitability. Um, so, but yeah. Um, let's talk to the wife. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Um, in fact, do I have winter seeds? Yeah, I have a lot of winter seeds. <laughs> um, in fact, I might expand that out so that I just have a constant stock of winter seeds going. We do have grapes and we do have corn. Um, I did want to sell these first though. Um, and that one. Okay, let's uh, start on the crops. These are all um, repeat grows, so we won't need any seeding from anything we see over here as of yet. Um, so, and I do believe I got everything. We'll collect that later. And then let's get the grapes. Um. Because it's more than good. It's grape. <laughs> um. Let's throw these down here. And... Okay, there is no wool, so we don't have to worry about the shears. Um. Jatina has no milk right now. Um, yes, talk, 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 talk. Um, okay, I need to say hello to all the hens. Um, Witcher, Bomu, we got two truffles. That's actually really good. Sama, no, what's that, Frown? Frown, no. Oh gosh, I'm getting the names of my animals mixed up. <laughs> we got a silver egg? That's interesting. I thought all large eggs were gold. Huh. Well, that's unique. Um, let's head down here. I need to run around collecting all the batteries, apparently. Uh, that is going to stay there until the next harvest. But it doesn't look like there's anything else needed. And we didn't harvest anything that required seeding. No, we didn't. Okay. So let's head into the shed where we have a bunch of veggies that are done. 
Um, yeah, we only get corn juice. <laughs> we'll throw the grape in there. Um, and we will pull out the garlic and we'll throw the corn in as well. Um, and then the garlic. And we are almost out of the veggies, so we're going to be starting to make jam here soon. Because we have plenty of stuff to make jam with. <laughs> um, oh, wow. We actually had a lot right there. Um, yeah, so that looks good. Let's go and sell. Um, this, all of these... And that should make us a very n nice profit. Um, let's get the oils going. Let's get the eggs going. Let's get the milk going. And we'll throw the other void egg in there. And then in here, the pine tar. We do have oak resin. Let's make those two barrels because... Or kegs, because it should be done soon. Oh, we're out of copper. Uh, we need a load of wood and the oak resin. Make two kegs. Uh, put the wood back. Um, How many more kegs do we need? One, two... Three, four, four. No, um, we need two, but we need uh, two more jars as well to finish that off. Um, let's head back down to the skull caverns because why not? Um, we are still looking for that. Uh, we don't have any big food on us, so. Mm. We do have two spicy eels, though. I'm going to try to wait till I need to eat one before we do anything, though. Um, let's get this copper. And gold. Um, but yeah. Ooh, hello, mummy. How many of you are there? There's two. That's not bad. Okay, come on. Come on. Uh, not right now, dragon. I'm trying to blow up mummies. Ooh, I got a miner's treat from one of them. Hmm. And a way down. What in the world is that? Just an iridium rock. Okay, that's kind of... Looked cool. Very anticlimactic. Um, we do need to fizz... Ooh, that crit. I love that ability. Um, there's no other ability that I wish to have. Um, <laughs> that was just amazing. It's just, Well, it is just amazing when it works. Oh, we found a hole, so that's where we're going to go when we are done. Um, nope, back here. Um, actually, yeah, we're just going to jump down that now. Um, but yeah, that was really kind of anti- Holy, we fell 15 levels. Yes, we are eating the spicy eel. Um, epic level frozen tear, right? Oh no, frozen tears don't get epic level either. Huh. That's interesting. Uh, some more sap. Don't mind if I do. Uh, that is a lot of rocks. Um, I cannot include you in on this. Unfortunately, because... Can I actually just put... Yeah. That's interesting. And another hole. 
Um. Where's my fingers? Uh, I had to turn off the alarm. <laughs> um. Yeah. Uh, let's see if we can't get a few more. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, and your buddy is stuck. Nope. Okay, you're good now. And quickly, quickly, quickly. Right there. And more solar essences. We have so much solar essence today. Hmm. Well, here's another hole. Jump in. Five levels. Into another mummy area. Which is interesting. Um. Um, just a cherry bomb. And there we go. Um, sorry, intense concentration. <laughs> I do have the issue that sometimes when I need to concentrate, I just can't talk, so. Um. Yeah, might as well. I am starting to hurt a little, though. Let's actually eat that other spicy eel. Yes. Okay, let's mine up a little bit more. Ooh, another hole. Yep, we're jumping in. Okay, that wasn't too far. Um, we have not had any music the entire time we've been down here, actually, which is quite interesting. There was just so many rocks in there. It had to be done. Um, yes, yes. Nope, nope. Um... Anything else in this area? We got some aquamarine, but not really, but you know what? I can actually just a normal bomb. It's not that big of an area. Um Okay. And I do believe we had a way down over here. Yep, two of them. Um Ah, critted. That, that ability is so nice. <laughs> I don't know why you would ever get the other one. Um. Because, like, you, you just kill stuff so quick. Um. Yeah, I have five Void Essence. I have 30 gold. So, right now we are limited by the Void Essence, which is actually not terrible. Um, holy rocks, Batman. Um, though this area really is not very good for, um, using any explosives. Oh, mushroom, yes. Oh, two of them at that. We will take that very happily. Nope, nope, and nope. Okay. So that's another void essence on the stack. Let's run around, see if there's anything else. There is a jade up here. Um. And nothing in that. Okay, well, let's head down then. Um. Some slimes. Um, yes. Ooh, yes. <laughs> Iridium. Don't mind if I do. Uh, more Iridium. Some algae. Um, we're actually doing really well in the mines today. Other than we're not actually getting the few things that we... Well, we're getting a lot of Iridium, so I'm, I can't complain about that. Um, but I really do wish that we could get that rabbit's foot off of one of the dragons. Um, 
And it actually, now that I think about it, makes a little bit of sense that they would drop the rabbit's foot. They drop a food that increases luck. So they must have some luck in some capacity. So one of them having a rabbit's foot would not be so far-fetched. In that manner of thought, at least. Ooh, some rubies. We'll take those. No room. Uh, we don't need the dwarf scroll. That's for sure. Okay. Let's uh, head back around. Um, actually, you know what? Bomb right there. And that works. Um... Um, anything from you guys? No iridium? Oh, yeah, one. That's fine. That's good. I won't complain. Um. Ow. Nope. Stop it. Go away. <laughs> we can actually make a couple mega bombs right now. Let's do that. The limiting factor was... Both gold and... Void essences, because we ran out of both. Hmm. Uh, we do have the way down right there, but it was a good thing we checked, because iridium, even though that only gave us one, that iridium stone gave us, that broken one hit gave us more than that one. <laughs> oh dear, that was a drop. Ow. Um, that's not going to help much, but some for the time being. Uh, we do have some more iridium right there. Anything? Or, obviously it's going to drop something, but... Two is not bad, so... Oh, oh excuse me. Mm. Um... Oh, dear. I must have killed the little ones as it popped. Oh, nope. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. We're not going to sit in that. Um, there we go. We got another algae. Um. Hmm. And knock you up here and kill you. Uh, we could throw a bomb right there. Ooh, another hole. Okay, then. Um. Let's eat one of these. Well, actually, let's jump in first. And then eat it. Immediately after. Seven levels. We're down at level 45. This is the deepest we have ever gotten. Um. I got a battery? That's interesting. <laughs> I, I never knew that you could get batteries out of those. Ooh, a diamond. That is certainly going to be useful. I could use a couple mega bombs to clear out the rocks in here, too. Because they're all nicely packed. Um, nothing from you. Nothing from you. Okay, then let's uh, get some mega bombs going in this place. One over there. Um, I'd say one right there would work pretty well. Um, and we did get a way down, so we will take that. Um, oh dear. Dragons. At the same time, huh? You can't get me like that. I know how to stop you. We have enough batteries. Actually, that was worth a thousand. I should not have done that. Um, well then. It was actually m worth more than the topaz and aquamarine put together. <laughs> all of all of the topaz and... I don't have any topaz. Anyways, all, most of the gems put together do not equal the cost of a battery, so I should not have done that at all, but... Um, some more iridium. Even though these things are actually pretty terrible with the drops, it seems. 
that killing these slimes can has a chance to yield more. Um, but not always. But there are a lot more slimes too, so. Um. And there's a way down down here. So we'll take that. And we have earth crystals, right? Yep, okay. So we're just gonna grab that then. And check really closely right here. What is that? Um, hmm. What do we want to drop for the moment? Drop the frozen tier. What are you? 712 plus 25 crit. Um, unfortunately, you are still terrible. Okay, we're going to get going because it is getting late again. Um, yeah. Uh, jump into the bus. Yes. And we'll get going. Back home. To organize all this out. We'll probably make quite a profit today. Because not only did we have all the... Uh, the other stuff. But two emeralds. Two diamonds, a frozen tear, three amethysts, an aquamarine, four rubies, two jade, three earth crystals, uh, 59 slime. Uh, we could actually make a couple more mega bombs, which I kind of want to do. Not to mention, we did get 22 iridium, which is quite a bit of iridium. Uh, how much coal did we get? We got quite a bit of coal. We got enough that we can do one of these um, without having to grab any extra. Um, How much does that make of everything? Oh, we have enough iridium to actually finish off our tools now because with the four in, that puts us at 17. And it needs five each. So yeah, we'll uh, get started on that in the next episode. Um, and we have just a ton of stone. We have three full stacks. Holy cow. Um, well then. Maybe making stone fences. They'll wear out faster. But as well as getting all of those omni geodes processed in the next episode but that will actually be it um thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed if you did please do leave a like as it does help the channel and do subscribe if you're not already to catch the next episode as it comes out um if you have any comments questions or suggestions you can leave those in the comment section below, and I will get back to you as quick as I can. Yeah, very, very high profit day. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching, and have a good one. Goodbye.